Ah, such a long journey. Finally, we're here. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to another video. Today, we're in Vienna. So today, I'm here to attend a conference on behalf of my company. My company is Service Rocket. So you probably will see this video on the other channel, which is my company's channel, Service Rocket channel. Remember to click the icon at the top here to watch that video as well. Quite a long journey to get here. I woke up like 6 a.m. today in order to catch the flight from London City Airport, which is my favorite airport because it's near my house in London. And then it was a two hour flight, I think two hour half to Warsaw, Poland, where I did a quick transit, which was really, really tight because it was like 35 minutes. So late for my flight because I only have like 35 minutes of transit time. Uh, but thankfully, it's already 11.40 and my flight leaves at 12 and I'm near the gate. But thankfully, I made it here. So I'm gonna take you guys to Alison Open. So let's go. The weather suddenly became so sunny, it's so amazing. Just now it was so cloudy. But we are here guys. We are at Alessian Open Vienna 2019. Okay, let's head in there and see how we can check in. Hey, yeah, good day. Are you YouTuber? Oh yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, um, I'm here to register. So exactly, how do you do please put in your last name. Okay. All right. Yes, and then okay. push print again. Okay. Currently printing and I need an ID. Okay, oh yeah. This is your badge. Be okay. sure not to lose it because there is a uh, replacement fee of 75 euros. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, quite a lot. So make sure to okay. keep to it. Okay. This. All right. Perfect. So you're Thanks all set. very much. You're welcome. All right. Bye. See you. <laughs> all right, guys, we got our badge now. So that means we are now official attendee of the LSN Open. Let's check out the Open Expo and see whether we can get something to eat as well. And oh, it looks amazing, guys. Ha! Huh. Now, I understand that some of you viewers, especially the ones on my channel, we may probably do not know anything about Alessian. But you probably would know Trello, which is behind me over there. And Trello has been bought over by Atlassian. And Trello is something that even content creators use, like video creators. Like whenever you have an idea, you will put it on a to-do list. And then after to-do, if you're already working on it, you can move it to in progress. This is essentially Trello cards. Uh, it's really good for you to organize your life, even your daily life. Like maybe if you have chores to do, you can just put it on the to-do list, which is your backlog. And then after that, you move it along. Uh, it's really easy to use. I can link it down below if you are interested. You can download it and try it on your mobile phone. It's really, really helpful. It's gonna organize your life and you're actually gonna finish your task for the first time in your life. So yeah. Hi. How are you doing? Alright. Good. 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 What's your name? Jordan. Jordan Fuji. Yeah. Yeah, how are you nice doing? to meet you. Where are you coming from? Uh, I'm from Malaysia but I live oh. in the UK. Oh, yeah. right. Oh, excellent. excellent. Yeah, so the thing is, I'm trying to get my viewers to start using Trello. Oh. So uh, I was wondering whether you can show them like a quick two minutes demo on why Trello would be good for them. Yeah. And also maybe after that we're going to discuss like what is the future for Trello. Yeah, uh, sure. Isn't? Okay. So what we're seeing here is a Trello board. Yep. And on this board we have some elements. One would be the lists and the other one would be the cards right here. Okay. Mm -hmm. And it's really easy to create a list. You just click on the board. Yep. To create a list, you do like this, and then inside your to-do list, you can create like you know, grades, a video. So this could be your to-do list. Trello can then you can turn it into sort of like a workflow. Yeah. What you're really achieving is to have kind of a control process of your workflow, and you can get more people to get involved with it. And the nice thing about it is that it's super flexible and it's very very visual as well. Oh yeah. Okay. 
Okay. What is the market positioning for Trello versus Jira? Will Trello be enterprise ready or will you target enterprise customers? Yeah. I mean, we are only in the cloud since the beginning. There's no sort of preferences, but if you're a non-technical team sometimes, or kind of a smaller team maybe, or a bigger team but you're like sort of less IT oriented or technical, you might want to look at something like a Trello because mm -hmm. it's not necessarily uh, a ticket, everything's a ticket, you yeah. need, or you just want to use Trello for a brainstorming session, or you want to use it like just as a placement holder for information, right. because it has so many use cases, it's so flexible, yeah. then Trello is really adequate for that. Mm -hmm. But uh, what we're seeing more and more is that uh, teams are using both tools. Mm -hmm. And uh, so you can connect Trello with Jira as well. Yep. There's a power up for that. Well, thank you. You've been very helpful. Yeah. I've learned a lot. I hope the viewers learn a lot as well. So hopefully there will be more Trello users. Yeah, fantastic. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Awesome. Nice to meet you. Can, can, can I get a t-shirt by the yeah. way? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Tell me power ups that I have. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, yay. Thanks very awesome. much. Thank you. Alright, the expo hall is quite nice. So many booths, so many presentations and uh, I even got a free t-shirt, <laughs> which is great. Now I think we're gonna head towards the keynote address. I think it's a keynote address, not sure. It's a general session uh, and that's gonna be in a hall somewhere. So... Open keynote in the hall. Okay, alright, thank you. that you are in for a treat. We have worked so hard to pack the next day and a half full of incredible content and incredible opportunities for you to meet each other. So let's talk about organizational change. How many of you have a change that you would like to make in your team or organization? Raise your hand. Oh great, I see a lot of hands out there. Okay, now how many of you would like somebody to tell you exactly how you ought to change so that the organization and team should get better. Not seeing as many hands. And that right there is the tension. The tension between those two sides is why we find organizational change to be hard. What's up? How's it going, buddy? Good. How's things? Good. 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 Jonas, have, have you met already or? Oh, no, I haven't. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice to meet you. Oh, by the way, this is Joe and Jonas. Hey. They are my customers. Okay, you cannot see the tag. <laughs> oh, good to see you guys, man. Yeah. So, do you guys enjoy it so far? Yeah, it's really good. It's really interesting. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, I think there's a lot. I mean, you'll know from the conversations we've been having, there's a lot of stuff that they talked about. Oh, yeah. There. There's like, there. yeah. Exactly. Like, like, yeah. Music to my ears. Yeah. yeah. Joe was like, every 10 minutes, but this is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm Ryan! <laughs> wow, what right. is this? This one? This yeah. one? Yeah. This is uh, Zaha cake, it's Austrian. It's Austrian. Yeah. So what's in a Zaha cake? Uh, it's chocolate with um, apricot marmalade. Okay. Can I can I get both then? Yeah, uh, can you, I get you, this? You can get everything. Oh, I can get everything. Oh, you, you shouldn't, but you can. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thanks. What's this one? Oh, this is punch cup. It's really, really, really sweet. Excellent news. <laughs> I don't I don't eat many desserts or many sweets. Yeah. But when I do I want it to be like attack. Yeah, it does actually. <laughs> Good. Yeah. Thanks very Thank much. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bye. 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 <laughs> What's really? up, man? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Daniel is with us already. Hi. So I'm not alone today. Yippee! All right, let's go. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to day two. Today is a bright and sunny day, which is a welcome change from the cloudy and gloomy yesterday. Beautiful weather. And today I'm gonna go back to the conference hall again, but I will be joined by two to three other service rocketeers. So I won't be alone today. All right, enough talking. Let's go. Hello. Thank you. 
Mike. Good morning, how are you doing? Good. 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 Better. How was the keynote? Do you enjoy it? Yeah. yeah. Yep. Awesome. You spend a lot of money sending people on an agile training course, you just don't create an environment for them to be agile. So you've spent money and you've pissed off most of your employees. There is a cheaper option. Because <laughs> see, some people are frugal and I like this. The cheaper option is shorter fall. You just take your old waterfall projects and break them down into two week chunks. You save a shitload of time on training, loads of money, and actually you're just pretending. You put a few posters up, call it shorterfall. Most organizations call it hybrid, um, which isn't the best of both worlds, it's neither of either. And you're like, again, you've missed the whole point of agility. So how do we understand the way to make our organizations and our people evolve? So we're joined right now with all of the service rocketeers. So there's three of us right now. This is, of course, you've already met him. Daniel Brum from Toronto. From Toronto. Rodrigo from El Salvador based in Chile. <laughs> is that correct? Yeah. Okay. And are you going to make any announcement on this video? No. No? Which oh. one? No announcement about... No. Not that. <laughs> not yet. Not, not through your video. Hi, Santiago. Uh, hi, Santiago. Alright. Right. Time for lunch. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Take care, guys. All right. See you. Here you go. Just um, you know, you just get a ticket. And come back at 3:15. You have to be here for the drop. Oh, very sneaky. Very really sneaky. <laughs> Thanks very much. Very sneaky. The conference. We love to see him around the conference. All right. Uh, this is a uh, L. All right. Thank you. Thanks very much. Uh, yeah. Take care. Hopefully we win. Hopefully we win. We'll be back here at 3:15 though. All right. So here's the medium. Okay. And then the, uh, she, oh, here we go. There, that's Thanks. Really Thanks. 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 Thank you. Thanks for coming back. Thank you. Nice to meet you, Edwin. Nice to meet you. Take care. Thank you. I wish you all the best. Cheers. <laughs> Alright guys, got lots of goodies, but now it's time to go for more sessions. Including the guy that just gave us a t-shirt. I think he's gonna chair a session right now, a keynote. So let's go and let's get surprised. Oh yes, because that's agile. Because whether you're in business, making pizzas, or running a bank, or launching rockets, I believe that IT is at the forefront of driving change in any organization. Thank you so much today for your attention, and please enjoy the rest of our day. Thank you. All right, so many sessions. We're just so tired. Are you tired, man? I'm no, so tired. No, no, no. You're not tired. He's just I'm, like, I'm, I'm, oh I do CrossFit. <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you think about the session so far? Pretty interesting. I, I really love the one from Dominic Pierce. Mm -hmm. uh, it was the future of work or something yeah, like yeah. that. He shared really good insights on how to work across teams and coll collaborative tools and all that. It was pretty amazing. I really enjoyed that one. Nice, nice. And where are we right now? Uh, we're at the Gliffy stand. They are ruffling a Lego set. A Lego Technic. Yeah. A, a Lego Technic. Yeah, it's pretty yeah. awesome. So we got our tickets there. Let's hope we win. Yeah. First ticket, 210064. Oh, so close. 64? <laughs> no. Not here. 210114. So. I have another question. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright guys. But well, 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 you can all wear t-shirts. <laughs> so oh, oh my god. It's alright, it's alright. To, no problem. Which will win something just for them. <laughs> Thanks very much. No right, keep one, keep one. Yay! <laughs> Two hours later.
All right, guys, so the open is finally over. Oh man, I was so tired. And right now, we are joined by Toby. Toby used to work for Service Rocket, my company. But then right now, he's already started his own company. I'm gonna link it down below if you're interested in the add-on that he's actually selling. It is an amazing add-on. <laughs> What's the Thanks, name Toby. of your company? Is it Tools Plus? Tools Plus. Tools Plus. Yeah, it's gonna be in the description down below. And right now, we're gonna walk around uh, Vienna and gonna see maybe the first district because Rumors has it that this place is really, really nice. So I'm excited. Are you excited? Super excited. Let's go. guys this is the last stop and we're at the Maria Teresa Plaza Maria, how do you say that in German Maria Teresa Platz mm, okay and that's the possibly the statue of Maria Teresa I'm not sure because it does look like Queen Victoria okay don't hate me in the comments I know I'm a I'm a Dumbo and what is that again the art history museum the art history museum and behind me that's the Museum of Natural History Very nice So yeah, I guess we're gonna end the video right now If you like the video, give it a thumbs up If you dislike the video, give it a thumbs down And as always, don't forget to subscribe Choose life Don't, don't forget us <laughs>